Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Poncho here. Um, currently I'm playing Diablo 3 on my 42 inch Vizio and it looks really awesome. It's in 1080p, um, playing in 120 hertz. It looks really good. And um, since I don't want to use my keyboard and stuff for my bed, uh, I'm using an Xbox 360 controller. And I'm using it by using this program called XPatter. I've actually been using it for years. Um, basically it takes all the inputs on a 360 controller and it maps them to, you know, different mouse gestures or any, pretty much any key on the keyboard and it's really cool. And this is my video showing, you know, what my setup is and stuff. I know a lot of different people have different setups, um, but this is, this is just mine. So, basically clicking in on this stick, um, zooms in and out, clicking in on the other stick shows the map. Using these sticks uh, is um, pretty much the mouse. This one is a slower version and this one is a faster version. You can click the left bumper to um, it's mapped to period and period just makes it so where you're constantly running in the direction of where your mouse is pointed. It's really cool for um, just traversing your way through the map and uh, also right trigger is a left click which is pretty confusing but it can get used to it and um, you can move by doing that right trigger is holding shift and when you hold shift and you click it forces you to stand still so I can um, just attack in any direction it works really well uh, speaking of attacks um, my keys 1 through 4 are mapped with X Y B and A but since my fourth attack isn't unlocked yet I just have um, A mapped to right click and as soon as I have my fourth um, little slot unlocked on this character I'll just map it to the number four and um, that's pretty much it. Oh no, the D-pad um, is uh, the inventory. Up is inventory for me. Down is inventory for my follower. Left is the skills, and right is uh, opens up a town portal. Um, and that's pretty much it. And with this little layout, I'm able to comfortably play Diablo 3 from my bed. It worked out a lot better than I thought it would. Um, and basically I'm just going to go find some enemies to kill and do a quick little demonstration of how I pretty much play. It works out really well. Um, fraps, I don't know what the problem with Fraps is, but it really just, it takes a lot out of my, out of recording. The frame rate really drops. I'm able to play at 60 frames per second, but as soon as freaking Fraps comes on, down to 20, I don't know what the hell is going on. But as you can see, it's a, it's a lot, it's really easy to play Diablo 3 from a controller. It works really well. Um, I'm actually really surprised that uh, Blizzard hasn't implemented a controller scheme yet. But hey, cool, I just love it. Um, but, you know, there's some rumors that, you know, uh, the actual dev team was using a plus and six controller. I remember reading that article on long time ago. And, um, you know, it's good news for people who you know, just like to chill with the controller. Uh, personally, obviously, uh, I started playing Diablo 1 with a keyboard and mouse, so I'm more used to it. But it's really nice to have an alternative every now and then. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I thought I'd uh, find more people to kill, but, um, not yet. This video is really lasting longer than it should. But, you know, this is pretty much it. Um, it may take a little bit to get used to, but, you know, I'm it's second nature to me now. I've been using this scheme for, like, maybe, like, five, five hours, something like that. Works really well. Anyway, um, if you guys want, uh, just uh, post in the comments below if you guys want the uh, file to where um, the profile for this x batter or whatever, the configuration file, that's what it's called. Um, and I'll uh, just go ahead and upload it. It's, it's small. <laughs> But let me go ahead and kill this guy. Uh, anyway, that was some blues drop. Look at that. Anyway, um, if you guys have any questions, just let me know. Uh, and that's pretty much it. All right, cool.